And then during the second month of the show airing, I realized that the show just the most hated show in all of Boston <laughs> because A, because Boston Red Sox fans are insane. Psycho. Psycho. Fan. And in the other, because they saw this show as it's kind of emasculating the virility of the Boston Red Sox. So, so they're a party last summer, and there are four huge jock guys all talking about this show. It's called Sox Appeal. It is a show. So, <laughs> so they're like, oh, this show sucks. Appeal. It sucks. I hate it so much. The worst show. I it sucks. I hate the show. It sucks. I hate it. I hate it. So my friend was like, oh yeah? Well, Chris wrote the theme song for that show. <laughs> so this is the theme song for that show. <laughs> Search for and wanted to see if I could find a woman I could call my own. So I could buy her a ring and I could build her a home. But I always ended up by myself with the blues in my heart and my love on the shelf. So I went from Chicago to Detroit, Michigan. But left the singles bar thinking I'd ever have a wish again. And off to San Minneapolis and maybe St. Paul. The girls that have an accent I don't understand at all. Tell me your boys have been across the world. If you want to fall in love, go find a ball. Couldn't have been worse. I was kissing with a girl and her implant burst. I didn't want to close on her, but I just want to be. So I moved to San Francisco, but my she was a he. And oh, the pain the Salt Lake City, Utah. If you look at a girl, you're breaking the law. Even at a date, the psycho in Seattle. We're picking the restaurant, and the movie was a battle. And in Phoenix, Arizona, had a candlelight dinner. She ate with the hands and wiped her face with her fingers. Tell your boys I've been across the world. I want to elegant and intelligent Boston. So I was picking the weed. 